I have funeral shoes. It's a strange fact, but it's a fact. Over the last four years, my wife and I have buried as many people, close people, and particularly in my wife's culture, burials are involved, very involved. You often find yourself in the grave with the dirt, sometimes in the rain, and sometimes shoes get ruined, so I have funeral shoes. Things can often be reminders of experiences, tangible markers for moments, big and small, sad and happy. I have clothes which note extremely positive memories, my wedding suit, my vacation t-shirt. Then there are my funeral shoes. They are quite plain, black Bostonian wingtips. They were on sale, and while I thought they would become part of my professional wardrobe, they now sit bagged in my closet, covered in earth, awaiting the next passing. These foot coverings spark no joy, Marie Kondo. They bring only melancholy. These are not high fashion pieces. If I'm being honest, I would expect to see them on a much older man, more seasoned. In this way, they are ironic. The number of funerals in recent memory is much higher than it should be at my age. Someone much older should be wearing these funeral shoes. But alas... In all things, though, you can find a saving grace. My funeral shoes are a valley, not a peak. They are unbagged and worn with low frequency, more than I want, but not often in the grand scheme. Putting them away is cathartic, and I am glad I do get to put them away. Dread though I do, their next wear, their next layer of dirt and earth. <laughs>